And welcome back. It's 40 past the hour. Joining us this morning, we have Karen Rhodes. Thank you for coming in, Karen. It's fun. Yeah. <laughs> now, you're here representing the Upper Peninsula Animal Welfare Shelter. You pause. But you're also here representing the Copper Country Humane Society also. I and know. This is an interesting combination, but there's a pretty interesting tech, uh, tech NMU uh, game series coming up. So what's happening at the hockey games to help out the shelters? Well, we've been uh, at the NMU hockey game the last three or four years, courtesy of Downtown Eye Care. Mm -hmm. And this year, uh, our sponsor, Downtown Eye Care, said, hey, how about if we help out the Copper Country Humane Society too, since it's the dogs versus the cats, NMU oh. versus MTU. <laughs> yeah. And we call Copper Country and they said, sure, we want to do that. So it's going gonna, it's gonna to be a win-win for both shelters. Nice. Now, uh, it starts Friday night up at Tech. And that'll be the donations mm -hmm. given to the, uh, the Copper Country Humane Society. Yes. Saturday night will go to you, Paws. What kind of items are needed, uh, you know, to help out the cats and dogs at the shelters? Well, uh, cat food, a canned cat food, um, um, you know, toys, treats, mm -hmm. uh, clean old bedding. If you've got a, a bedspread that you can't stand to look at anymore and it's clean, <laughs> donate it to the shelter and our dogs will love sleeping on that on their caranda bed. So things that you think your pets would like, our pets would like too. Wonderful. And all they have to do is bring them to the game? Bring them to the game. If you're not going to either game, you can always drop them off at either shelter too. It is a great way. You know, regardless of who wins these games, Games. we're going to let the local cats and dogs be the real winners in this one, right? We are. And at both places, we're going to have volunteers there with uh, donation canisters. So okay. if you don't want to carry a heavy, you know, bag of cans to, you know, you can drop in a few bucks to our canisters because all that money goes to help the shelter pets. Quick and easy. And, Quick and easy. And I know that we're going to be broadcasting those games here on mm -hmm. TV6. So if you can't get to the games that way, if you, you say you want to stay home, of course, go mm -hmm. to the websites of either of the shelters and uh, you'll be able to find ways that you can help out. It's always great to see how the it volunteers is. from both of these shelters really step up. <laughs> it is Very nice. And we'll have pictures of adoptable pets there and, and shelter volunteers to answer questions. So it's going to be a nice opportunity to kind of see what we do. All right. Well, Karen, I want to thank you for coming and letting us know about this. Oh, they say fighting like cats and dogs, but it's all, it's going to be fun. <laughs> it's good. And don't, remember, don't forget, we're also having our first annual snowshoe race That's on right. Saturday. Check out uh, all the details on our website. We're still looking for more participants. Wonderful. Thank you much. So if you are uh, getting out there, it's good exercise for your heart. Mm -hmm. And it is heart month, so we are also being very up to date on that. Tell you more about it on your TV6 Morning Show continues.